Hey everyone, um, I'm going to show you another way you can level up trade fast since the GMs have all said that uh, rolling with a trade pack could be used, uh, could be seen as an exploit and to not do it. So same things you're going to need is the whale meat salad, either 10% from non one or blue is 15%. Uh, also you're going to want GM's blessings or the hearty grilled turkey from that turkey event. Uh, that won't, they'll overlap with the, uh, I mean it'll overwrite the GM's blessings so don't use them at the same time. And you also want the flowing time elixir as well. As well as some pets if you've got some which might have life XP and trade XP so yeah, and of course trading flows. Um, I don't have any whale, whale meat salad, so it's going to be a little bit slower for me. So at the moment I'm professional six. Just want a wagon for this as well, um, and just same idea as the rolling with the trade pack. Just buy everything and. My wagon's gone. Oh, no, okay. Yeah, um, I'm in Heidel at the moment. I just go between Heidel and this farm over here. This is just like this. Straight shortcut through the uh, the trees, right to the next um, node manager, and back and forth until you've used up all of the trade items. Now this is slower of course, like a lot slower than the exploit, whatever. Um, by the time you've done all these trade items you should be able to change channel. So yeah, it's uh, about 10 minutes slower but you know, you're still going to get a lot of XP um, pretty quickly for leveling trade. So here you could either go around that uh, around the back of that house or you can just do what I do run here and sell it and remember to use the potions and then buy these and call the mount back through here You can do the same thing at Velia to Finto farm I think, yeah. You can do the same thing there, it's pretty easy, it's fairly quick actually, um, but it's definitely not going to be quicker than rolling with a trade pack on, but yeah, I'm not going to do that as I have gotten a response saying that it can be considered an exploit and they have to talk to the PA about it. So yeah. And since that other video has come out, uh, a lot of people have been doing it, but I've seen a lot of people do it, doing it with uh, ghillies on, so you know, I don't think... I think they know that it's probably not allowed either. Yeah, you just do the same thing over and over. Um, I'm at 43% now. Uh, I didn't turn quick. Sometimes you'll get the uh, the pop-up saying that your item has been damaged, but it doesn't really matter because it's still not destroyed or anything. As far as I know, it doesn't actually um, it does nothing for XP. It just decreases the value. I mean, this isn't getting you much money anyway with the notes connected. It's getting you a little bit, but like, I started with 200k and I've done this on two, two channels. 
yeah, I've done this on two cha two channels so far, so you know it doesn't give you that much. It's just for XP and rushing to um, Master Two is this the buff that you want, and then you can just go and do actual trade crates that you've crafted yourself because those actually get you money. I think it's about 3% each way. Not sure. Uh, it would be more, of course, if I had all the buffs. Uh, I don't know why I'm doing that. When there's no trade for crates, you just go back and then call your uh, call your horse, uh, your wagon from the stable manager. Sorry about the lag, it's the snow and also I just lag when entering towns. Okay, so I've gone ahead and done all the trade packs from Heidel. This is the last pack that I have just done. Um, as you can see, I'm 55% through Professional 6 now, from about 39%. Um, and that all took about 10 minutes to do. So 10 minutes, and I got about 15% XP. <laughs> I mean, it would have been a lot more if I had the all the buffs, like the one from... Um, the whale meat salad, which would have helped a lot if I had one of those.